Okay, this is a quick video on how to get back and forth on the battlements. Um, there are four of them. And this counterweight is the way to open them. There's going to be one of these over there that'll open that door. And as we move on, we're going to be shooting more of them to open the doors to come back and forth. Admitting you once was enough. Make sure that bug is down. Okay. So now these sun and moon doors can be very confusing. We are not going to touch this first one. We are going to leave it alone and we're going to head upstairs. Trying to get his leg. Next. Okay, now that we're up here, I'm gonna head in here and then drop down here. <coughs> head through here, drop down, move forward. Just to get that, and then to kill this guy so that he doesn't get in your way in a little bit. Oh, rude. God, I tried to duck. So you really want to get rid of him. Just because. Okay, now we're going to go this way. Now, we're in the basement area, and we are going to pull this lever. So it moves to the moon. So now all moon doors will be open. Alright, let's kill these two. Come on, Leon. Drop down. We're not going to pull the lever that was up there. Kill this guy. Get this treasure. Loot him. Head up. Okay, so now we're in Battlement 2. And we're in the locked room that is one level below, like, the top area. Oh my gosh, come on, Lantern. No, no grabbies. God. No, thank you. Okay, up one more level. Really? 
really starting to become And we're going to go over ass. there. Okay, first thing we're going to do is that one. It's this counterweight that makes it safe for us cuz the giant will sort of like move down. And we're going to get this counterweight, but we don't really necessarily need it because we're going up. Only You really only need that counterweight if you want to go back inside. And I don't really want to go back inside. But if you need to go back inside, if you want to go back to the merchant, if you want to go back and save, you can do that. Okay, so we're going to head around, run past these ladies. Excuse me. Hope the giant kills most of them. Now this is a little Castellano clockwork guy right here. I've already gotten him, so all you see is his feet. Oh, I was hoping he would kill her. They keep coming. Okay, then there's a treasure up here. Treasure, two barrels, and a yellow herb. Which should be the same regardless of your difficulty. This should all be the same. Okay, we are gonna head back down. Oh look, I missed monies. All right, we'll grab those. So now if you wanted to, you could drop back down again and go around and and head back out and go like to the merchant or save or go buy more ant like whatever you needed to. The option is there, keep it moving. Okay, now we're heading back up to the roof. There's the monies that I missed. And we're gonna go left. We're gonna go that way. Now this is open. Now you can go all the way through just on this level alone, which is nice. So let's go halfway. Oh, jeez, I can't believe he got me through the slot. Two guys in here, don't get grabbed. Oh, man. The giant, oh, I thought the giant would have killed that guy. Come on, giant. Come on, giant. Come on, giant. Take him out for me. I don't know. I'm out of shotgun, man. Help, help a Leon out, will ya? Ah! <laughs> oh, no. Sometimes you can get him to, to take them out, which is really helpful. Uh, barrel there, gunpowder here. I mixed it. I didn't take it. Okay. I think that's all of the resources that are up here. Pretty certain. Yeah. Okay, now here. I, 
I didn't... So, I'm pretty sure that this is a point of no return, because I don't think you can walk on that part. Shit! So ugly's got me beat! So I don't think that you can walk on that part, and I don't think that we can get back up here. So, as far as I can tell, because this top part is completely missing and he can't walk on that, I don't think. Alright, give it, we'll give it a shot, but I don't think so. Yeah, see, he's just going to drop down. So once you drop down here, I'm pretty sure this is like a point of no return. So if you have anything to do, if you want the merchant, or you want to save, or you want to buy something, or whatever, um, do it before you drop down from here. Now this is the end of the chapter once you get out of here, so you're not too far from a merchant if you need one. But if you're going for, like, a treasure run or something, you're gonna have to, like, come back around. And I'm... I feel like... I haven't sort of looked at it. There's a locked drawer and a cubic device box in... If I click that thing and it floats, I'm not gonna be happy. Um in the audience chamber and you don't get the cubic device until like chapter 9 which means there has to be a way to get back to the audience chamber unless it's just a troll placement which I guess it could be but this is really only like my third placement so I honestly I'm gonna say this is sort of a point of no return if I'm wrong please let me know I would love to know how to like get back but just in case Oh, it probably connects over here. Oh, courtyard connects to the beginning. All right, ignore me. The courtyard connects to the beginning. That's right. So if you do have to go back here, you can. Because the courtyard, there's a gate here that does open by the merchant that's right here. All right, my brain. All right, so it's not entirely a point of no return. It's just a point of it's going to take a while to get back. <laughs> Let's just call it that. So just do it while you're up there. So then... Because you won't be able to get back until after the courtyard. Yes. Cannon. Hope it works. Okay, and then if you are looking for one, there's a locked drawer right here. There are three keys in the castle unless you have a leftover one from the village that you have no don't climb up loot loot no climbies looties now climbies these guys first because I can then we can open the door all right open for traffic okay is there any loot up here I don't there's a barrel okay there's a barrel back here now when you drop down there's gonna be one more counterweight so if you want 
to get back into this fourth battlement, you can. Like, so that it's easy to get back to the locked drawer, because there's a couple of keys in the castle that you'll come across. And if you want to know where all the locked drawers and where all the keys are, uh, I'll put a link in the description, because I, I do have them written up. Out of the way. So there you go. There's the battlements. Sorry. I've had my fill of you guys. 